Hey BFFs, in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to connect your MailChimp account to your Facebook business page so that you can start collecting email addresses for your mailing list without having to have your website done. So, whoops. So, <laughs> there's a few parts to this. The first part is to connect your Facebook account to your MailChimp account in MailChimp. So as you can see, I've logged into my MailChimp account and to connect to Facebook, I want to go to my account. So I click up here on my picture in the top right and then click on account. And then I'm gonna select integrations from this list. And then I'm going to click on Facebook and log in. And so now it's gonna log me into Facebook and I'm gonna click OK. And I'm gonna share posts with the public. I'm totally fine with that. And now MailChimp would like to manage my pages. So I'm gonna choose what I allow. Oh, okay, it's gonna let me select my um, business page here in a minute. So I'm gonna click OK. And now, I am connected, my Facebook account is connected to MailChimp. So now I just need to select what business page I want to use. So I'm going to select WordPress BFF and I want to connect that to my five day website challenge mailing list. And it's asking me if I want to use a sign up form tab. I'm going to say yes. My forms theme, I'm going to choose Facebook esque. Well, actually, let's let's see what both of these look like first. Let's cite my lists theme. And then we'll save and then preview on the Facebook page. And then the tabs label. What do we want the tabs label to be? I'm going to change instead of email sign up, I'm going to say um, click here to join the free five day website challenge. So we've got that done and we are going to save that and let's test our connection. Yay, we can access your Facebook account. Here's the info we grabbed from a profile and let's preview on our Facebook page what that's going to look like. Great, so let's see what that did to our Facebook business page. If you scroll down here, you're going to see that you have apps and now you have this envelope with a rainbow that says click here to join the free five day website challenge. So I'm going to click there and then you can see that my MailChimp sign up form is right here and I don't know what this untitled field is I must have something wrong on my sign up form that I need to fix but you should just see email address and first name and I'll show you where to um, make that change here back in MailChimp in just a second um, but if we want to get this to show up in our main let me go back to our main Facebook page that's not how to do that we'll go I just did it again. If we want to go back to our main page, you can see that we have timeline about photos, likes, and whatever, but I want five day website challenge to show up in that so that people can click on that and sign right up for my mailing list. So I'm going to click on more and then I'm going to click on manage tabs. And I am going to slide this up higher. I can't bring it to the top, but I can bring it right below about, and then I'm going to click save. And now you'll see that on my business page, I have that option right there at the top on my Facebook business page. So anybody that comes to my page can click here and sign up. So how do I get my um, sign up page to look like that? Well, let's go back over to MailChimp and we're gonna go to lists and we're gonna open up my five day website challenge mailing list. And we're gonna click on sign up forms general forms and then we'll select the sign up form right from the drop down that's the very first one it defaults to that and you can see that i've added an image 
um, all that stuff, I'm going to actually remove this untitled field because I don't need it. And I don't want to, yeah, that's what I want to do. Why didn't it let me do it? And I have these hidden fields and that's okay. I'm gonna keep those there. Um, and I'm gonna, I think I saved this form. So when I go back over to um, Facebook and I refresh this page, that untitled should be, the untitled field should be gone. Yep, it's gone. So if you wanna learn how to design your forms in MailChimp to look like this, you should check out my MailChimp Masterclass. I go into all the details of how to um, design all of your MailChimp forms. I teach you everything that you need to know about um, building the know, like, and trust factor, building your email list, building relationships, and building sales. And you can find out more about that at www wp-bff.com forward slash MailChimp. And if you want to join the free five-day website challenge and learn how to build your web WordPress site in just five days for free, you can sign up at www.wp-bff.com.